of us know porous pipe does uh, supply water through oozing principle. So whenever there is a dryness in the soil, water will be released. And uh, whenever the water level will go down, the water will be pumped in. The capacity of tank is kept little larger both sides. So we can take care during even rainy time. So water, energy, and fertilizer, all three we were been able to save. Means reclaim water is used. There is hardly 0.5 HP pump is used. And for any reuse of reclaim water, we need pumping, which is done without any or with very nominal uh, energy. And uh, NPK means which are there in the water is given back to the soil. So you can see in the operation and maintenance, there is no electricity use, so zero energy. Maintenance is only nominal, which is if the grass is grown too big during this monsoon time, or even if there is no regular cutting is done, only cutting is required to be done. And uh, that is the only lens uh, cost as far as maintenance is concerned, which anyone can do, or such big campus is already having a lot of gardener and other things. But the most important point is we have reclaimed water without energy, and for which water G is a new word in ECBC code. So water is reclaimed and energy is also saved, plus we have achieved nutrient recovery also at this particular project. So the, since last six years, this is working at SML. There is not a single issue is there. Even uh, I don't know right now anyone is connected from SML or not. But uh, till today, we have not received any complaint from our customer. Then in order to satisfy the authority plus to check what has been done, treatment efficiency, the testing was carried out for TSS, PH, BOD, COD, bacteria, nitrate, phosphate at inlet of septic tank, outlet of septic tank, outlet of wetland. So what happened is that all uh, uh, test reports were done but I will give you the little more details of what we did for the black water. The total capacity was 31.5 uh, KLD or 31,500 liter. In the area requirement, we did six septic tank and four constructed wetland. Total area requirement between the two is less than 8,000 square feet. Okay, inlet is this, excreta and all, outlet is this. Even inlet BOD was 94.4, outlet is 13.3. The capital investment for one septic tank with biobed was around 15 lakhs rupees. COD was 296 and uh, COD at outlet was 46.28. These are the detailed water test report. And see, when we do all this, the real bottleneck and challenge is very few customer allow us to do all this testing and all. These are very uh, scientific tests. Even the test samples are to be carried out in a very specific manner. Uh, even the, because microbial growth or even the bacterial growth can happen anytime. So all that care has been taken and this red mark is the results and you can see inlet, outlet, outlet of biofilter and all that. And these are the other details what we have done at site. One important achievement we got after this is uh, that Mount is a one-stop shop for sustainable sanitation solution for unsevered area, which we came to know that CSC is uh, gathering this information. We submitted our details and they have accepted our case and they are even now they have kept this project on their uh, mount uh, platform which is menu of unnetworked technology or where there is no sewer line these are the technology with our name and everything this is the link anyone can go and check even if they want to do and these are the locations and uh, the credentials are given this is the water balance diagram. Then after that, one lakh liter, like what Hariji you asked, day one, our domestic usage, if the full population is there, 
uh, was 105000 out of that 73500 liter is for domestic use and rest 31500 was for flushing so day one 30 73500 liter of domestic usage gave us 66150 liters of uh, gray water out of which we have used 31000 liter for uh, flushing and 32000 liter and 2300 liter for passive pooling and landscape irrigation now out of this 31500 liter 90% is again recovered and 28,350 liters is again reused for the kitchen garden uh, at site. So this is what we do did and uh, you can see that the total water 66,150 is consumed by uh, 3A, 3B and 3C. This is the IGBC certification we received. Uh, Suresh sir has only signed, but I don't know, he's aware about the technicalities of the project. Uh, this is the platinum rating we never aimed for, but we got it 